Jeff couldn't breathe. Yeah, yeah. 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 I just yeah. don't have. Just 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 work hard. Hard. Yeah. I just really couldn't breathe. Yeah, right. right. I've been like this for two weeks. All right, mate. Thank you. Yeah. Kelly, that was a great fight. Hmm. Yeah. Not great for me. Yeah. No, but tough night. There's nothing to be ashamed of. You came back. You know, the first round I thought you were gone, but you came right back. You know. Um, You're telling him nothing to be ashamed of. Yeah, no. there's nothing. Yeah, no. you think he doesn't know that? I look sure. all around the world fighting all these years. You know what I mean? I'm yeah. Sure. No, you're right. Sport. Yeah. Nah. I agree totally. Um, how do you sum that up yourself then, Carly? Youth. Yeah. That's all, you know. Mm. But uh, I had a good run. Yeah. Mm. Took some big hits there. Still came back there. That's what we do. Mm. Did, uh, what about the ones that got you? Just didn't see those coming at you? Um, I saw a few and I... No, I thought I'd just, and I ducked a lot. Mm. I was ducking as much as quite easily. Mm. And thought, I'll just keep doing that, and then one or two got in, and then it just sort of just changed everything, you know? Mm. 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 Where does it sort of leave you now? Well, I've got nothing left to prove, you know? No. no. It's time now. That's kind of the end of it from, from your perspective. I mean, you've, you've done a lot over the last year. You've got to have a beautiful <coughs> renaissance over here. Yeah, I've done, I've done, I mean, I'm happy with what I've done. Mm. Holding no regrets. It's just, um, it's a sport. Mm. It's our sport. Mm. You know, it has no mercy. And a good young fighter will usually always beat a good older fighter. Mm. Mm. You know, so. But I had to do it for my own reasons and I've done it and it's all good. Yeah. So is that kind of completion now? You don't think it, there's anything left to, you got nothing left to prove and nothing to sort of entice you back for, for a, a challenge beyond what you've been through tonight? Oh, there was never really anything to entice me. Just had to do it for some reasons, which I did, and then mm. see what happens. Mm. But uh, you know, I always say uh, I take every fight as my last. I don't make big plans because, yeah. you know, in case things like this happen. Stuff. So, right. uh, don't sad, man. No, no, I'm just, <laughs> uh, just in admiration, really. Uh, yeah, you put up a good think. effort, you know. Yeah. That's what we do. Because the way you came back, like, I thought it was, I thought it was over in the early rounds, but the way you came back was just, I was amazed by that. Yeah, that's yeah. what we do. It's just, yeah. um, I was hoping to land that left when he comes in. Yeah. He leaves his right hand down a bit, but I think I got him one good run, but I couldn't really tee up on him. You know? So was it his speed? Was it his power? Or was it, uh, as you said, just the youth, really? I think it was youth. Do you think, uh, you know, he can go on to fight, you know, and win fights against like uh, Anthony Joshua or? Uh, well, that remains to be seen. I mean, um, you yeah, know, I'm sure he's going to learn a lot from this too. You know, mm -hmm. because um, even though he was getting me, he got me with a good barrage early. I saw him really tiring, mm -hmm. and I was trying to just make him tire and catch him with big shots too, you know? I, I saw him tiring where I think he, he shouldn't have been tiring. And that sort of gave me a bit of hope, you know, but... Because I could see his mouth open, you know, he's yeah, breathing. I couldn't, I couldn't really capitalize on him. Mm. Yeah. Can I get your thoughts? Yeah. Yeah, just, just your reaction really, just what's going through. Oh uh, yeah, that's boxing, bro. Yeah. I mean, you know, he wins some, he loses some. Yeah. But you know, you can see he's, he's good, he's happy. I mean, nothing goes your way 100% of boxing ever, but um, you know, we still got each other. And I, I mean, now it's good he can also you know, put a lot of more time into me as a fighter and as my coach. So, um, yeah. You know, there was a powerful moment when you were holding the white, uh, the white cloth, uh, and you were sort of hesitating whether to throw it in. What, what was going on? I mean, were you hesitating at all, or were you going to definitely throw the towel in? If you get in trouble, if you throw the towel, he was timing it. Timing when the right time to do it, and, and you know, it was a powerful man, scene. It was just a powerful moment. Yeah. That's boxing. Just the son watching his dad, and you know. Yeah, of course. You know, you care for the people. Everyone, you have in the corner, you got to care for them because they care for you as well. So, um, don't want that to be done. Better man one of the night. Next job. We'll get um, Carly for him. Just uh, we'll just quickly do your interviews, and then uh, you guys are all free to go. Callie, what's your first reaction? Eh? Why is everyone here looking so sad? <laughs> <laughs> it's all good. It's um, it's it's a fight game, you know. 
when I've had my time winning and knocking people off their perch, and it had to come to me too, you know. Carly, oh sorry. He, he's known as one of the quicker heavyweights, and you've been in with a lot of heavyweights. How did you personally find his hand speed when you actually got in the ring with him? Um, I didn't find it unbearably fast. You know, he had fast hands, but uh, I thought I was making him miss mm -hmm. quite quite good. You know, and, and you know, I thought I could I could continue doing that and catch him with uh, left hooks and yeah. overhand rights. But you're looking to lull him into the yeah. I was I was looking him to yeah. just yeah. get him into some power shots, but yeah, he was good. He wanted some punches. Yeah, yeah. and uh, he done a good job. He came out pretty excited through a lot of punches in the first round. Do you feel like that was working in your favour? I threw a lot of punches. No, he did. He threw a lot of punches in the first round. Yeah, I mean, um, he came came heavy in the first round, and I, I, I weathered that storm, and I went back to the corner, and I thought, cool, I can weather his storm, you know. And um, I found that I could make him miss. I thought it was, you know, I was having some success there, making him miss um, constantly, you know, and then I think I was trying to make him miss, trying to make this, and I was looking for a, a counter punch, and then... I got me a couple of hundred lucky ones. How did you find the power? Um, typical heavyweight power, you know. Yeah, I wouldn't say I, I got one punch bang out, but yeah, good power. He, um, be, being obviously an older guy, it was no secret he was probably going to try and go to your body, which he did a little bit more in the second round, I felt. Did you feel those body shots make it? Um, but I, I, I took those all right. I done a lot of work on the body, you know, even though... Even though it was, wasn't looking too sharp, but I, 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 my body was hard, you know. Um, it's just, I think it's just youth, eh? yeah. you know. Everything, uh, every good thing comes to an end, and um, every young dog has his day, and every old dog ends his day. And it's just, it's just boxing. It's just a sport that we, we do, you know. Yeah. Has your day come to an end now? Well, I mean, it's close. I mean, you know, I mean, I'm not going to sit and say that's it no more. But you know, I'm not going to sit here and plan this and that either, you know. But um, yeah, but I mean, my main focus now is my son boxing, obviously, you know, so that, that's that's my main uh, goal now, which is to go at his career. In terms of fighters you've faced, how would you rate Joseph? Um, yeah, he's a good uh, prospect, a good prospect. He's, um, he works hard, which is good, you know, he he's fit and strong and it really helps when you have a good promotional company behind you, that which gets the country behind you. He's got that, so it's it, it, it all benefits him. Having been an opponent, what would you say then he could improve on? Um, well, that's up to his coach, I guess. But um, even though he got me with a uh, you know big barrage early, I felt I was making him tired. He was getting tired, so yeah. I thought I could just still hang in there, and then I could start counting with, with some shots. Yeah. But um, it didn't work. Yeah. So you felt maybe he was a little bit, a little bit too excitable in those early rounds, and, and, just, and if you could weather it, the, you know, the old pro. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But I um, mean, that just comes with experience, I suppose. You know, it was just like my son in this fight. You know, just use the jab first round. Yeah. You just say, ha, ha you know, throwing everything. It just comes with experience. But how did the result weigh up with your expectations of how the fight might go? Um, well, obviously, you know, you, you always fight to win. You plan to win and you believe yourself you're going to win, otherwise you shouldn't get in there, you know, because it's, 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 it's a dangerous place. And if you don't go in there believing in yourself, you know what I mean, you, you shouldn't get in there at all. You know, unless you're going to just do a dive or something, but that's not a, that's not a me, you know, so... Obviously, I guess, things that I saw in him, I could capitalise on. It didn't work, it didn't go my way, you know, but that's boxing. You said last week to me that you really look forward to the day when you were the old dog teaching the yeah, young dog yeah. a couple of new tricks. Uh, did you enjoy it as much as you thought you would? Well, in saying that, there's no shame in losing, because you're the old dog. You know what I mean? Like, I've, I've fought in Madison Square Garden, Mandalay Bay, fought for world title, you know, I've, I've fought for two eliminations, been Australia's top heavyweight for the last 10 years. There's no shame in me now losing at 45 to a young up-and-coming prospect. There's no shame at all, so... Yeah, I did enjoy it, and then I, I don't know, it's maybe I'm half nuts. I just wanted to be that young old dog one day and have the young lion trying to trying to knock me off my perch, you know. And if, if it happens, or like tonight, there's no shame in it. There's no, it doesn't really bother me too much, you know, because oh, I guess I've done what I've done in my career, you know. And, and fighting in West Auckland, sorry. how was fighting in West Auckland for you? Enjoy that. Oh, always the best, you know, always the best. Yeah, always good to be home. And saying that, were you happy with how you fought yourself? No, I. Um, I was trying to counter him with, I was trying to time the left hook when he came in, 
Well, they've had right, but I, I, I couldn't get my timing good. So he does I think little, he was yeah. seeing it. He does get it, a little square when he comes in, rushes in, and the, and the yeah, hands yeah. go down a little bit. Hands go down, and he, and he takes big steps as he yeah. comes in. So I was pretty confident about the timing of the yeah. shots as he came in. Like a mark, he's to be Yeah, sort of thing, but it's always um, easier said than done. Do you think in activity, I mean, if you had maybe the chance to have another perhaps 12 months, it's a bit Oh, out. mate, it's never a perfect world, eh? Right? You know, going 12 months in that fight. Yeah. You know, like I said before the fight. What he's done Just a quick question, Willis. Do you think you might get a chance to maybe avenge your father's loss, like against the fight with Parker one day? Yeah, of course. You know, yeah. me and Joseph are going to cross paths eventually one day. Um, or whether, it's, you know, sooner or later, it's yet to be known. Um, I guess it's just I'm going to make myself fit and ready. Yeah. And the opportunity to uh, avenge the loss. So that's it's going to be a pretty amazing fight to watch, right? Yeah, of course. Yeah, something to look forward to, huh? It is. It is. You know, he's got. Um, some big plans for him at the moment, I guess, and yeah. so do I. So, um, whatever it takes us to our meeting one day, I know we're going to meet mm -hmm. in the ring. So, um, just about your, your fight as well. You seemed a little angry with the ref. I mean, were you upset that he didn't stop it earlier? I mean, was yeah. that what it was? Yeah, yeah I was very yeah. angry. My job's to fight. Exactly. Let me yeah. to fight. The ref's job's to protect us. Yeah. You know, it's not he took a little too job. late, you think? Yeah, way too many. He should have stopped the fight at the first round, but um, let me say, <laughs> I haven't seen him after the fight. He's in good nick, so. Yeah. Um, that's a fight business. Yeah. 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 It was nice to see a fellow boxer care for another boxer, you know, so that was cool. Yeah, yeah. we're just humans. <laughs> Thanks, man. Thanks, man. Thanks, man. <laughs> You know, you did come to, come to win from us. I did, I did. Oh, you know, some, some of the last guys we've seen it not really put much up, but, you know, I think, it, I think the crowd really respected the game. I hope so. Yeah. We're going to go there and start throwing the corners in. No, 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 no. That was amazing. Thank you. 100% we came to win. Yeah. That's right. No, you did it. You can see it. I think you did a little bit.